Welcome back to Remote Hustle HQ. I'm your girl Saranda and today I have some great job leads from CVS Health Company. I'll be explaining at least five different opportunities but they have very many opportunities with CVS and all you have to do is go to their career page at jobs.cvshealth.com and as usual I like to show you all how to find these jobs so that you can look around and see what fits for you but before I get started please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe or comment and let me know what type of jobs you're looking for let's go ahead and get into these jobs um, so you go to their career page and either you can put remote in the search box and that's one way to bring up the remote I like to hit the search it'll go all to their jobs and bring you on over to this page and on CVS page they have a place where you could just hit remote and hit search and then it'll bring up all their current remote opportunities right now it says they have 903 live um, results and they have a lot of different job categories CVS will be a good place if you're looking to be in the health field but you don't necessarily have to have any health background or health degree they have some that are degree jobs such as nursing like telehealth and engineering jobs they have a lot of different areas that you can go into but you don't necessarily have to have a degree in any health field so this will be a good company if you just want to work in the health area and get your foot wet or get your foot in the door on dealing with health jobs and so go ahead and check out their job categories see what interests you they have a lot of different job categories from customer service to engineering nurses medicare and medicaid positions and so forth they also offer a lot of different opportunities as far as scheduling some part-time some full-time they also have some jobs that you could click on and say hawaii and it'll show you what's um, available in there or if you live in Puerto Rico it'll tell you what uh, jobs are available in that area but most of their jobs are in the United States so go ahead and just check out they have a lot of remote opportunities now with this first position um, I pulled up it's for a billing consultant and so you'll be dealing with billing and customer support you'll be verifying information with the customer dealing with customers issues resolving their issues and kind of like a support system so if you don't mind dealing with billing and finances overlooking accounts that is what you're going to be doing making sure things is in compliance with regulations with the company for cvs and different health um type companies that they are working for that is what you're going to be doing so if you're interested in overlooking billing data entry customer support overlooking different accounts and calling customers then this may be a job for you with this role you do not have to have a degree they just are looking for a customer service experience some microsoft application experience and those two things and so um, they are also looking for if you have a bachelor's or associate degree and then that is preferred qualification but you do not have to have it this is the pay for this position you can get up to $29 an hour and this is a great opportunity if you're looking for that type of job I'm gonna go ahead and go into the next job lead but before I do go ahead and take note of this job ID it makes it easier it is based out of Columbia but you can work this job anywhere it is remote and go ahead and check this job out if it interests you this next job that I have pulled up to share with you all is for a medical claims adjuster here's the job ID make sure you note it or stop or pause the video it is remote and so in the medical claims adjuster you're looking over medical claims 
for health insurance coverages for customers this row did not mention that you'll be too much on the phone so if you're looking for something that's more like email chat support then this may be a job for you for the medical claims you'll be handling customer service inquiries and their problems overlooking the accounts to see what coverage you can offer them in this medical claims adjusters role and that is kind of what you'll be dealing with so if this interest you this is a no degree job and uh, so if you are interested go ahead and apply because these type of jobs go very fast for the requirements it's all is asking for a little background with communication customer service you are able to um, handle multiple assignments and then their preferred qualification is if you have a associate's degree that's all they're looking for and if you're familiar with dg system claims processing and that's a software that they'll be training you on on how to do these medical claims with this position you can earn up to 37 dollars an hour I always try to negotiate the top pay if especially if you know you have some type of background in health ever worked in a clinic or if you ever have customer service experience then you can do this job and this is for the medical claims adjusters I'm gonna go ahead and go into this next job this job is for an eligibility consultant you are overlooking the accounts to see if you can get customers and clients uh, eligible for different health claims and health uh, benefits and so if you love to do eligibility um, and helping people apply to um, different health coverages and things on that order and enrolling people you'll be maintaining the enrolling database and looking over applications and clients records to get them enrolled in some type of health um, benefit or health coverage and so this is a great opportunity if that's what you're looking for um, this is the job ID number it is remote and for this job you do not have to be degree they are just looking for you to have some type of background and data entry researching information if you're good on the computers have customer support this role did not mention any telephone for this role when I was reading the job description so go ahead and check it out if this interests you now they do want you to have some experience um, like I said some type of customer service member service type experience that is all what they're looking for administrative work experience customer support um, data entry typing if you have those skills you could do this job all they're looking for is a high school diploma it pays up to $29.88 for this role it says they anticipate closing this role on July 19th so get your applications in this role that I want to explain to you is for a benefit benefits verification representative all these roles are kind of like explaining benefits with the exception of billing consultant that one is strictly dealing with billing but this one you're overlooking the process to see if they qualify for benefits and health coverage for customers that are trying to apply so if that is an area that you like to do um, being a benefit verification specialist overlooking applications seeing what is wrong and what's the hold up for their coverage then this is what um, you'll be doing in this role and so if this interests you they're looking for someone Monday through Friday from these hours listed here and they are looking for a critical thinker someone they can count on and if you have any outlook experience those are the things that they are requiring you did not have to have a degree for this row it pays up to $27.90 so if this row interests you um, it actually lists two different payments one for 27 and the other one is 28 dollars and 45 cents depending on your experience and your background um, so get your application in and this is for the benefits verification representative it is remote and that is the job uh, job ID above here and so take note of that and let's go ahead and get into the next row 
This next role that I have to share with you, you will be a Medicaid provider enrollment coordinator. So you are helping people get on Medicaid. You're coordinating on how that works. And so you'll be overlooking accounts. You'll also be looking at applications. You'll see any discrepancies in the applications or overall accounts for people who are trying to enroll in Medicaid. And that is what the job summary is going to pretty much tell you as you go and read it. Um, and this role, you do not have to have a degree. They do want you to have any credentialing experience. Um, that's data management processing um, overlooking accounts such as these with Medicaid knowing the laws and procedures and HIPAA rules they do want you to have a yeah, background in that customer service able to work um, manage workloads and so that is what they are requiring for this role so if you feel like I have this type of experience where I dealt with Medicaid and Medicare and things on this order you can do this role they will train you for all these job opportunities you're the person that is overlooking that process for credentialing a uh, credentialing and contracting and things on that order dealing with policies and procedures and so if you feel like it, you could do this role then go ahead and apply all you need is a high school diploma um, and experience in this background and you can get paid up to 28 dollars an hour which is some good money and it says they anticipate closing this job on tomorrow june 26 of 2024 so if this is something that interests you go ahead and get your application in now cvs have a lot more roles that you can go on their page and um, kind of check out these were the jobs that i decided to share and highlight for you all so if this interests you go ahead and get your applications in don't delay and this is something for anyone actually to do all these job roles does not require a degree some of them want just a little bit of experience and so go ahead and get your application and go ahead and come on over to their career page your jobs.cbshelp.com thank you for tuning in today i hope you all let me know if you get any interview or any jobs and i hope you have a great rest of the day and until then i see you in the next video